So if you look at set number one, so uh, let's just go over something really easy and also some misconceptions that's possible because I had this misconception before. So looking at this, all right, looking at this. Uh, so on the left, you have y is less than or equal to uh, x plus two. On the right, you have y is greater than or equal to x plus two. So can you see the line x plus two? Okay, so that's a solid line right there. And the question is, how do you determine which region to shade? Depends on the inequality sign. So if y is less than the equation, I mean, is, is less than the, uh, the, uh, the expression of the line, then we will shade the below, right? And if y is greater, then we shade it above. Now that's really easy, right? So uh, uh, it's really easy. If it's less than, we shade it below. If it's greater than, if y is greater than, we shade it above. You know what misconception that I had before when I was a kid? I didn't think about this as above or below. I thought about this as left and right. So it was so confusing when I was a kid because I was like, how do you know which side to shade? How do you know you shade the left-hand side? So I was asking the wrong question the whole time until later that I realized that, wait, hold on. If you just look at this part and this part only, can you see, can you see that when y, is the, when y is less than the line expression, we shade below. And I was like, oh, that makes so much sense. The answer is right in front of you. Can you see how the answer is right in front of you? It tells you which side to shade. Okay, are we good for number one? Okay. And then now let's go ahead and set number two. Can you spot the difference between these two graphs, Emma? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. So uh, so the inequality sign would be able to tell would tell you the difference. If it's just less than or greater, let's just less than or greater than without the equal, then you use the dotted line. If it is with the equal, then you use a solid line. Okay. So between set one and two, we visited two really crucial concepts here in inequality. One, it's which region to shade. And number two, how do we decide what kind of line that we would use? It all depends on the sign. Is it with the equal or not with the equal? Then you know if it is gonna be a solid line or a dashed line.